But then if you start dropping the time frame to daily to four hour, then you're going to see that the structure is, is not necessarily always in, in, a, in a bull market. Like for example, here, this, this is obviously a channel trending down. Then here we start putting a higher lows and not necessarily higher highs. So it's kind of sideways, kind of sideways, yeah. sideways, but breaking this heavy downtrend, which we inherited from last year and, and kind of going sideways and trying to prove the point that we can recover. But how, how do I see what, what is the act right. in, in a situation like this? When we see something from four hour daily or weekly, and you see the, the lower lows, the lower highs constantly being sold out, that's a bear trend. And when we are in a bear trend, we are looking for a bottom. And if I feel like we are in such a bear trend, I start getting bullish on grid balls because I think we have already dropped X percent. In a, as, I, as I show you before in the chart, Sometimes you can fall 60% and then you can fall that another 60% further. But those things have happened two or three times in history of Bitcoin. So in, in 10 years, they're less likely than just doing a sideways and maybe slightly lower. So the risk of running a grid bot and the chances that you can you know, exit that grid bot in profit sooner are higher when you have already corrected decently, you know, yeah. 30, 40% down, then I'm start, starting to think, mm, maybe there's going to be an opportunity with a great grid bot, you know, because now yeah. we're going to go slightly bearish, maybe find that final bottom, then do some sideways right before resuming the uptrend. And I prefer, I'm not saying that if you do that, you're going to in one month, make a 50%. It's not like that, but there is certainly less chances of getting wrecked than when you've been doing higher highs and higher lows for many months. Like yeah. this, this is definitely yeah. an uptrend. You know, you can see, you can confirm it for almost three, four months that constantly put in higher highs and higher lows. Unfortunately, this is when people get the most bullish to do the grip bots. And that's probably the opposite that I will do. And if you heard the, the say, do the opposite that the people are doing, uh, that pretty much is the inverse very training. true for, for grid 